We got it to power up, couldn't get it to crank. Jake will be back in a few minutes. He has a forklift, he'll come up here and lift it off. All right, so we were unsuccessful to get it started. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna turn the trailer around. Jake's gonna go over with his forklift, lift it straight up, and then he can just pull the truck out from underneath it. We don't have to risk dropping the car. So let's see what happens next. Well, we're getting this moved inside and boy, it's not sketchy at all, let me tell you. Oh man, it's too wide to get through the gate. Oh man. Okay. Oh. Oh, I don't like this at all. I might actually pass out, Steve. Now is not passing out. Nobody gets to pass out. It's supposed to be it. Huh? Oh, yeah. oh my god. <gasps> oh my god. Lights, I need light. <laughs> I can't see if I'm gonna hit this pickup. Okay. You're good. You're good, just go straight. Once he gets past the Baja, it's wide open. Still good on this side. How is he looking, Steve? Okay. Hold on. Steve's gonna roll a bug forward. Okay, now he's clear. Keep wide open. Wide open, Jake! Forward! We're coming up to a corner, but okay. Okay, now start your turn. Start turning. Not so sharp. Straighten out. Straighten out. Watch the Maserati. Yeah. Got that board up there. Good. Got about 10 feet. Got about 10 feet. Yeah, more like four, but who's counting? You coming? That's probably good. I wasn't nervous at all. I swear to God, I knew it was going to be fine the whole time. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. We are two weeks fresh off of Las Vegas and we are using our Copart money and some of our money from the auction to put into this Bentley that has uh, been a big goal of mine to achieve this. And getting it unloaded was quite the challenge. I have wild plans for this car. I want people to hate it when they see it. We're gonna go full body kit, we're gonna put a mild wing on it, we're gonna do a wrap and some awesome wheels. So stick along with us, let's see what we can do with this old POS. And the air suspension is completely flat, so it's going to take a wheel lift and dollies. Okay. So if Steve gets it running, you kind of tear the front end down and get us an assessment of what parts we need. And then I'll work on peeling the wrap. That's going to be the fun part. Woo-wee! Engineering at its <laughs> finest. This is uh, the Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania uh, copper. Very valuable. Highly skilled technician put this in. Lots of coils to help, help with the resistance for the toggle switch for the cooling fan. At least we think that's what it goes to. I don't remember being hired for that. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like my work. We have oil and all that fun stuff. Oh, uh, we haven't checked. Six car hauler on the top and the middle. So dude was supposed to be here at 10.30 in the morning. Called at 8.30, said he'd be here in two hours. Didn't get here till like after six. Pouring rain. Jake next door got his forklift. And <laughs> lifted it up and the dude drove the trailer out from underneath it but the car was so low on the ground once he set it down he wasn't going to be able to get back underneath it come around to the gate to pull it in the back and it's too long to fit through the gate sideways <laughs> so he had to lift it up higher than the gate god. and drive through i was like oh my god dude i was just <laughs> just panicking i was clinched the whole time i really like this w12 twin turbo yes this is a good idea. 
I like this very much. Wii games, kids! I'm really excited about having such a complete car, actually. Me too. Yeah, this is way better than what we started with last time. Yeah. And the best part about this car, freebie, because we used our Copart money yeah, to buy buddy. it. So the only on top I had to pay was the shipping, and I think it paid $1,000 just for, for fees and taxes okay. and bullshit. But, so here's our $1,000 Bentley. Oh, damn it! What happened? The back window's broke, and it's got the spoiler, too. Uh, might not be expensive. Is it front, too? Yep. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. I guarantee you, there's 10 grand in two windows there, at least. <laughs> I had an independent inspection done on this. And his notes, it said at the bottom, the only redeeming quality of this car is the W12 engine was not damaged. I disagree. You know, we got four wheels. And four wheels. That's a whole lot more than we had in the last one. No, none of the airbags blew? No, we couldn't push it at all. And it's 6,000 pounds. You're right. salvage on this car. Whoa. It looks like you got yourself a free key. Oh, you got free house. Oh, no, dude, this is definitely a key it. to like some vault with like lots of money in it. Mm. And it's got some writing on it in Spanish. You better hold on to that. That mm. definitely goes to something in on the other side of the border, huh? Uh, yeah, it does. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah. Santo Cristo, huh? That? You want that? Hygiene is key. Oh, boy, Louis Vuitton? I recognize that name. Oh, boy. Rustoleum striping paint. Oh, dude, this this car is a is a wonder. Oh, this heat is the way to do it. Oh, I did take that one. We're almost at it. Okay, okay. it's gonna make it easier to paint. <laughs> did a great job today. We've got a laundry list to get to and uh, it's gonna be a quick one. We'll have the driving in no time at all. Can't wait to get going on it. Thanks for sticking along. Please share, like, and subscribe. And don't forget to donate anything you want. Time, parts. Parts, we need parts. Donate parts, please. Parts galore.